All right, welcome back to this free-for-all Friday edition of Focal Point on AFR Talk. Brian Fisher is my name. You are listening to Focal Point on AFR Talk, the American Family Radio Talk Network. Uh, one thing I want to mention before we go any, uh, go any further, we just uh, celebrated this terrific celebration together of the Gap becoming very Christmas-friendly. In fact, I'm, I'm thinking when you look at what they're doing in their stores, this may be the most Christmas-friendly chain of stores in America this Christmas season. So it's, it's just great to be able to invite our network, our listeners, to say, hey, maybe this is a year to think about shopping at the Gap. Maybe this is a year, even if you don't shop there, go in. If you're in a mall that's got a Gap store or an Old Navy store, if you don't buy anything there, just go in and tell them how much you appreciate the Christmas theme they're incorporating into their advertising uh, this year. So that's uh, that, that's just uh, just a really a neat deal. Uh, and it was, it's kind of fun to enjoy that together and celebrate that together. And another way we can participate in the Christmas spirit is by wearing Christmas buttons that we here at AFA have prepared are beautifully designed. Got a scr- If you're looking at TV or video streaming at AFR.net, you'll see a picture of it, of the button up on the screen. The message on the button is a light has dawned. It's beautifully designed, beautiful colors. Got an outline of a nativity scene. It's a beautiful, beautiful button. That's from Isaiah 9-2, which says the people who walked in darkness have seen a great light. Those who dwell in the land of deep darkness, on them has light shone. That's the inspiration for the motto on the button, a light has dawned. We've been doing this Christmas button campaign since 2006. We have a fresh design every year. This is a brand new design. You can get these in packs of 10. The price includes shipping and handling. Uh, We sent out over half a million of these last year, an opportunity to wear them and share them. And we're making a big push this year to have folks wearing these on Black Friday. So uh, we urge you to uh, go to AFRstore.net, AFAstore.net, or you can call 877-927-4917, 877-927-4917, and order up multiple packs of 10 buttons. You can wear them, you can share them, share them with your family, share them with people in your Sunday school class, your church, your small group, your extended family, and our goal is just to have the United States of America just flooded on Black Friday with people wearing these Christmas buttons, a light has dawned. So that'd be delicious, everybody wearing a light has dawned AFA Christmas button while shopping at a Gap or Old Navy store. So again, afastore.net or 877-927-4917, wear them and share them. Now, I'm pleased and honored to welcome to our Focal Point studio, uh, Riley Wildman Davis. She's the associate director of one of the divisions of the American Family Association called the AFA Foundation. Riley, uh, welcome to Focal Point. Thank you so much, Brian. Glad to be here. Great to have you here. Now, when people hear the AFA Foundation, maybe they're hearing it for the first time, and they may not know exactly what that's about and what it does. So tell us a little bit about what the foundation does. Yes, um, we are a, AFA Foundation is a division of the American Family Association, and um, we also help with, um, is a financial stewardship ministry um, with the AFA, and we help build family legacies through uh, bequest. Um, we do charitable gift annuities, wills, and trust. And you do this in uh, in kind of um, I don't know what the word I'm looking for, but you partner up with Dan Celia to we do, do this. We do. So a lot of our listeners are going to be familiar with Dan. He's got a two hour program on every morning on AFR Talk, and you obviously know Dan's uh, insight, his wisdom when it comes to financial matters, and so he's he's a key part of the team here at the AFA Foundation. Yes, that's right. And in fact, um, if you ever have any questions um, regarding, um, have questions for financial advice or need help in any of that, um, we'll be glad to help in any way we can. Um, if, even if you have a complex situation, um, you can give us a call or um, if we need to sit down and see it necessary for a visit, we'll be mm-hmm. glad to do that. Well, and Dan's a very bright guy, and uh, you and Diane and the others that work there with the AFA Foundation are doing an absolutely great job with this. And another thing I want to uh, talk about specifically is what AFA Foundation does both in the spring and the fall with these town hall meetings. Tell us about those. Yes. Um, in the fall and in the spring, we have about 
four or five in the fall and four and five in the spring. Um, Faith, family, and finance town hall meetings with um, Dan Celia. And it is just a great time for people to come out. It's free of charge. Um, from 6.30 to 8.30. Um, we have them in different locations around the country. Mm-hmm. And you got a couple coming up. We, we do. Make sure we do. Um, the one coming up next week in, um, is Tuesday in Fayetteville, North Carolina, November the 12th. Um, that's going to be at the Holiday Inn um, in Fayetteville. And then November the 14th, um, is going to be in Amarillo, Texas at the Ambassador Hotel there. So November 12th, that's next Tuesday in Fayetteville, North Carolina. Yes. Thursday in Amarillo, Amarillo Texas. Texas. So if people want to register for this thing or get more information, how can they do that? They can do that by going to um, AFR.net or they can give us a call here in the foundation. That's um, 1-800-326-326. 4543, and that's extension 345. Okay, well, that's terrific. So, uh, AFR.net to get more information to register for one of these uh, faith, family, and finance uh, town halls. I want to thank you, Riley Wildman uh, Davis, my guest. She's thank the Associate you so much, Director Brian. of the AFA Foundation. Thanks for dropping by, Riley. Thank you. All right. So, we got a lot to celebrate today. Uh, you know, this gap thing is just such good stuff. I mean, you know, I tell you, every day we're fighting a winnable war, and I know there are days when some, it, it may be hard to believe that at some sometimes because the news out there can be uh, kind of discouraging. And yet this is huge. This is the gap. This is one of the 